Good morning, good afternoon, good evening friends. Today we are going to discuss on database administrator interview questions and answers especially designed for the freshers. So most of the freshers are doing database administration course and they are just giving the interviews. So for those freshers these interview questions are really valuable, important. Also if you have 0 to 5 years of database administrator experience also for those people also these questions are very very helpful. So watch this video till end. If you want these interview questions and other interview questions like application support, SQL interview questions in PDF format, then please subscribe the channel, click on bell icon and send me mail on complexsql at gmail.com which you can see on the screen. So let's get started. First interview question, what is database and why it is important? A database is organized collection of structured information or data typically stored in electronically in the computer system. Databases are important because they allow the efficient storage, retrieval and management of a data, which is crucial for various business operations. So to understand these things, I have given the example. Consider an online retailer that needs to store the information about its products, customers and orders. A database helps manage this data efficiently, ensuring the quick access to inventory levels, customer information and sales transaction. Second interview question, what is SQL and why it is used? This is most asked interview question, what exactly the SQL is? SQL stands for structured query language, which is a standard programming language used to manage and manipulate the relational databases. It is used to querying, updating and managing the data. Example for SQL, SQL query like select star from customers where city is equal to New York, which retrieves all the customer records from New York City, enabling the quick analysis and decision making for marketing strategies. What are acid properties in database? Answer. ACID stands for Atomicity, Consistency, Isolation and Durability. These properties ensure ensures reliable transaction processing in the database. One, Atomicity. Atomicity ensures all the operations within transaction are completed. If not, the transaction is aborted. Consistency ensures the transaction brings database from one valid state to another. What exactly the isolation is? Ensures the transaction are processed independently. Ensure the transactions are processed independently. Durability ensures that once transaction is committed, it remains so even in the event of the system failure. For example, in bank transfer, automaticity ensures that either both accounts are updated, money debited from one, and credited in another or neither updated maintaining the database consistency and integrity properly okay simple next interview question what is normalization and why it is important normalization is the process of organizing the data to reduce redundancy and improve data integrity it involves diving a database into two or more tables, defining relationship between them. Example for the same, in school database, instead of having all students information in one table, normalization might separate the student contact details and course enrollment into different tables. This reduces the duplications and ensures the data consistency. Next interview question, what is primary key? A primary key is a unique identifier for a record in the database table. It ensures that each record can equally identify that no duplicate records exist. Example, in student's table, student ID can be the set of primary key, which ensures each student has a unique ID or you can say it as roll number. Okay. Roll number is very unique for student's data. Foreign key. What exactly this foreign key? Foreign key is the field or collection of fields in one table that uniquely identifies a row of another table. 
it establishes a relationship between two tables example in students table and courses table a course id in students table can be the foreign key linking to course id in courses table representing the courses for each student is enrolled in explain the difference between delete truncate command in sql delete removes the rows from a table based on the condition it can be rolled back if used within a transaction it can be rolled back if it used within a transaction truncate removes all rows rows from the table but it cannot be rolled back it is faster because it doesn't generate individual row delete statements example using delete star, st delete from students where grade less than c will remove the students with grade lower than c whereas truncate table trunc truncates whereas truncate table students will remove all records from the student table what it next is what is indexing why it is used indexing this is very important question because you are facing you are always facing the issue in performance optimization for performance improvement optimization indexing is the key part indexing in is database optimization technique that improves the speed of data retrieval operations indexes are created on columns that are frequently searched used in join conditions example in large employee table creating index on employee name column can speed up the queries that search employees by name what is join in sql what are types answer a join clause in sql is used to combine rows from two or more tables based on a related column the common types of joins are inner join returns the records with matching values in both tables left join returns all records from left table and match records from right table right join returns all records from right table and match records from left table full join or full outer join returns all records when there is a match in either left or right table to get list of all records corresponding to the customer name you might use select orders dot order id customer dot customer name from table orders inner join this is the clause which we are using inner join customers on orders dot customer id is equal to customer dot customer id next interview question what is stored procedure and when would you use this the stored procedures a stored procedure is set of sql statements that can be stored and executed on database server stored procedures can be used to encapsulate complex business logic improve performance enhance security by controlling data access example to update the employee salaries based on the performance you might create a stored procedure SQL create procedure update salaries as begin update employee set salary is equal to salary into 1.1 where performance is equal to excellent if performance is excellent then your salary will be increased by 10% what are different types of backup strategies this is also important very important question for the dbas answer for the same common database backup strategies include one full backup a complete backup of entire database second differential backup backup or backs up only the data that had changed since last full backup incremental backup 
backup only the data that has changed since last backup of any type full or incremental example in production environment a typical backup strategy might involve taking full backup every sunday and differential backup every night ensuring data is recoverable without excessive storage use what is data integrity and how do you enforce it in database what exactly the data integrity is data integrity ensures the accuracy consistency and reliability of a data throughout its life cycle it can be enforced through constraints such as primary keys foreign keys unique constraint and checks example for the same to ensure that email address in user stable are unique and not null you might define the constraint like create table users user id int primary key email varchar unique not null these are some questions and answers which will provide you the comprehensive foundation for the freshers i recommend you to go through all the interview questions and uh, just prepare for your interview hope you like this video if you like this video kindly subscribe the channel click on bell icon if you want pdf for these all interview questions and other interview questions as well please subscribe the channel click on bell icon and send me mail on complexsql@gmail.com which you can see on the screen right now thank you